the excellent Gill. Gill was emaciated and often ill when he was a child. He knew that he had to build up a healthy body if he wanted to succeed and do anything else. So he changed the habit of reading mechanically to cultivate new habits like running, swimming, or playing soccer. One day, Gill went to the countryside and saw some children climbing trees. He thought it was a good spot to keep fit, train courage, and cultivate flexibility. So he involuntarily walked to the tree, clasped his arms around it, and climbed up. Because of the lack of strength, Gil still had not lifted his feet off the ground, which made the children laugh. Gil was not discouraged. He came into the ground every day to practice. Even his clothes were worn out, and his hands were blistered. He did not even say a word. Gil's father saw he always went out to climb a tree and came back with dirty clothes. So he said angrily, "What a disgrace you have been climbing trees all day without studying, Dad! I need to be stronger," said Gil defiantly. "Keep practicing." So I can regain courage, strength, and conscious living. Do you want to see me become a sick man and not achieve anything? The father kept Gil at home was because he did not want him to get hurt from outside. But he forgot Gil was a human being. Hearing Gil's words, he supported Gil to took him out playing. After a long process of hard work. Gil became stronger and stronger, and he eventually made it to the top of the tree. Standing on the branch, looking out into the distance, he was relaxed and happy. Gradually, Gil's body grew stronger and his mind broadened. He pondered away at his studies and became an outstanding writer. Gil realized that his weak body and frequent illness would affect his normal life, so he began to find ways to exercise. His father did not agree at first, but Gil did not give up and eventually convinced his father. Gil was responsible for himself. He knows what he has to do and what can make himself better. On the journey of life. Everyone goes through many pains. Also, making changes in life is hard, and if we don't make a conscious effort to set ourselves up for success, failure is almost certain.